Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name's Ken. Today's experiment is magnetic money. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is a US $1 bill and a very strong magnet. Simple steps here is to hold your uh, $1 bill down and hold your strong magnets and run it across the different parts of the dollar bill to see where it's going to pick up. And uh, you should be able to hit it on different areas of the $1 bill. Well, the reason it's able to pick it up is our U.S. dollar bills are printed with magnetic ink. So when you try this experiment for yourself, you should be able to find some part of the bill that's magnetic and you'll be able to pick it up from there. When the U.S. Federal Reserve prints money, they use ink that contains iron oxide, which can be magnetized. The magnetic ink is used in a way to reduce counterfeiting. Normally, these iron particles are not magnetic. That is why when you pass through an iron gate, you don't see the dollar bills flying out of your pocket and attaching themselves to the gate. The iron particles are only magnetized when another magnet is present, or even when the magnetic strength is very weak. Vending machines use scanning technology called Magnetic Ink Character Recognition, MICR. It's used to verify the bill and the magnetic pattern on it to determine its denomination. Counterfeit detectors use similar technology to detect fake bills. Here, as you saw, we're using a U.S. $1 bill. So if you're from a different country, please try it out and see if your ink on your bills are magnetic. And please comment in the comments below to let me know which bills are or aren't. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to click thumbs up and to subscribe. Thanks for watching.